Here we are at the Carbon Canyon launch pad location. <laughs> What's up, dude? How you been? We got the flux capacitor back there, signed by Christopher Lloyd. Nice. We're trying to uh, stay healthy. Oh yeah, I hear you. Uh, and you got your time circuit. You did. Got it all set up. The only thing that's missing is the stuff on the outside. Yeah. <laughs> Put all that on. Sodium chamber. Yeah, of course. Looking good, man. The hand took energies. So how's the car running, dude? It's running really good right now. Yeah. Cool. I was watching the temperature just making sure it's now overheating, but it's pretty cool. Yeah, it's nice, nice. So this is Romel. He's from Delivering the Dream Part 2, Midwest Connection. So he's got this car here from DeLorean Midwest. Running good. New radiator just put in. New hand cooked energies. He's even got the matching white wall or white lettering rather going on here. Did you tint the windows? Yeah. Okay. Yeah, it looks good, man. 30%? Okay. All the way around? Nice. Well, not the back window. This is a little darker, huh? No, they're all the same. Oh, they're all the same. Okay. But, oh, you mean the back window is in that, that window in there. Yeah. yeah. You kind of don't need to tint that one, right? Yeah. Is that a camera? A rear view camera in there? Yeah. Oh, okay. Yeah. Okay. Cool. Does it work out okay? Yeah. Yeah. Nice. It nice. It's very similar to the original. Looking good, man. Really clean looking, even cleaning it up, that's for sure. <laughs> yeah, it's good. yeah. I saw those videos, dude, where you're like working on it. Looks, yeah, looks, it's looks decent, yeah. Inspired by you. Hey, you know. <laughs> Sweet, man. Hmm? Eight in time. Or is it 81? No, it's 81 in time. Because it's an 81 DeLorean. What's up, Martin? That is legit, huh? Driving around with mine, but I don't even realize it's so big. Yeah. Yeah, after work, let's house. We got Brandon's car. It's looking pretty good, too. What's up, Brandon? It's a 3D printer here. Sure. Check it out. We got iPhone 12 MagSafe cup, uh, couple, or what do you call it? Okay. Oh, there you go. Nice. So it charges the phone. It's also a functional extra you can open up and close. And this is my switch alignment plate, which is, doesn't have that cover over it, so I've got full access to all the switches. The DeLorean, uh, DeLorean nope. Go one is a little, not as convenient as you Oh, okay, okay. So, yeah. yeah. Right in. No, no zip ties needed either. Nice. It's, it's form fit to the actual tape of the car. Nice. I like it. I like it. I hit 15,000 miles. Oh, only 15, huh? Yep, only 15. Probably. Put 8,000 miles on it. That's that's pretty good. I I haven't even put that much on since I bought mine three years ago. So I probably put about six, maybe something like that. Okay. Okay. Uh, you talking about the um. Okay. Oh yeah, 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 yeah. Oh, gotta make sure you hit sixty, so. What is it at? Can you see? It's at uh, 60, almost 60. You get a little bit more, a little bit more down. Or sorry, sorry, up. <laughs> okay, a little more. Up is in higher, yeah. Okay. A little bit more. Up. Yeah, you're. Oh, yeah. I went back down again. Yeah. Push it. Push and hold it. I'll take it up to 60. All right, tell me where I'm at. You're almost 60. You're like 58. 
59. A little bit more. 50? No, you're actually back down to 57. <laughs> a little bit more, a little bit more. A little bit more, a little bit more. I see your your uh, mileage going up though. Yeah, well, <laughs> Creeping up, yeah. Car, yeah. That's interesting. No, you're not you're not at 60. You're right in the middle between 55 and 60. Now you're down closer to 55. Now you're 60. 60. Right on the nose. There you go. Right on the nose. So once it does that, it sets the memory, and that's how you can calibrate it based on your oh. size or anything. Oh, damn. So Did not even know that. That's for the, the Speed Hut Speed Bots, huh? Yep. Oh, okay. I had no idea. Off. And that's how you can get perfectly accurate on everything. Pretty awesome, good. man. No, that's, that's really cool. And then I also really put cool. the stainless steel uh, striker pin wheel on GPI. Ooh. Recalibrated the door, so now it closes Shiny. Those look nice. I don't have to clean it. Anyway. Cool. Sometimes. And the tail lights are coming soon. You've got to put the boards coming. Oh, yeah, yeah. So, so, I put them so, in the crisp. Okay. They okay. look damn, they look great. They look good, huh? Yeah, oh, I can't yeah. wait to see those, and man. And by the way, I can make a clear set. Yeah. Don't say anything, man. That's a secret. We put RGB Top uh, secret. We put RGB stuff. You're not rolling, oh, yeah. right? Yeah, I yeah, am. Yeah. Okay. We Live. Put RG, we put RGB clusters. You can actually spell numbers and digits. All right, you mentioned that. Yeah, kind of like my SID. Yep. You know, you can program it. I, mean, I imagine it's got like its own board and all that fun stuff. Is it a Arduino board or what? What are you, what are you using? Uh, this is Dennis's question. He'd be like, okay. Remember on the uh, Dorian weekend, he had the custom blackout? Oh, yeah, 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 yeah. yeah. I remember that. that. Oh, okay, okay, got it, got it. You know, no, I saw that, yeah. Once, yeah, that's once cool, I man. prove that it works, can I do a month of driving it? And then give them the file to the community for free. There you go. Like everything I do. Hey, man, awesome. <laughs> hey, nothing, nothing wrong with free. <laughs> yeah, well, free and then you can make it up. <laughs> All right, let's have a look at some of these time machines. So we got time machine number one, Lenny. This is a Bruce Coulomb time machine. We have your usual supply of standard issue DeLorean. So we've got DMC Time, we've got Tim, we've got Mr. Scrap Steel, Scrap Steel, Dave Daniels. What's up, Dave? Hey, hey thanks for hosting the event, the uh, launch pad event here. Always. So, how's the car running, man? Really well. Yeah, cool. I drove it probably about 30, 40 miles. Okay, good. Yeah. yeah. Always make sure to try and drive on the freeway, get it up to at least 15. Right. Right. Get it yeah. warm. Yeah, get it warm. Make yeah. sure it's not going to overheat. Yeah. All that good stuff. Yeah. Awesome, dude. Let's see, we got how many? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. ten. Right, ten. Yeah. Right, we're at, uh, we're at quorum. Yeah. <laughs> oh, we can vote on stuff? <laughs> yeah, we can vote on stuff now. <laughs> Believe it or not, this car is originally a Beverly Hills Car Club car that was completely restored by DMC California and has been running very awesome since then. Here we see Chris, 88 miles, standing next to his DeLorean. We didn't know it was a time machine this whole time, so. <laughs> Actually, this is Martin Sanchez's DeLorean. Time Machine, Back to the Future Part 2. Heading over to Mr. Chris Hogard's car from Delivering the Dream Part 1. And he's Mr. Hey, drone today, too. So we're going to get some really good drone footage oh, yeah. of the Carbon Canyon run. So how's the carbon running? Uh, pretty good for the most part. Um, trying to bring it up to Daniel. Daniel's been pretty soon for a couple small things. Nothing crazy, but yeah, it's driving good. from here today. Find out uh, how it goes. Yeah, absolutely. Make your way over to Lion Estates, 1955. <laughs>
Well, the interior looks really good, dude. Yeah, I like these seat covers, man. Regrain it, huh? Okay. Yeah, yeah. That, that has to. Yeah, it comes right up. No problem. Easier said than done, man. I know. I hear you. All right, everybody, that's the launch pad tour. We're about ready to start the run. We'll see you guys on the road.